Hello everyone, this is Lamin Sane of LS Web Apps and in today's video we're going to start covering arrays in PHP. Okay, so just to make this video short, I'll make an announcement that in this video I'll just cover the simple array which is numeric arrays, numbered or numbered arrays, some people call it. And in the following two videos, I'll cover um, two more um, complex arrays, okay? So just to keep it composed and short, I'll do that. Okay, so if you have watched any of my videos before, you may have noticed that I have used arrays. Um, and I actually did urge you to watch this video before watching those, but um, it's totally up to you. Watch them however you like. I made them independent of each other, so, um, but just watch the ones that you need to understand another one, okay? So to create an array, Let's say we have a variable my array, and um, starting from the latest PHP version, which is 5.5, .5, um, I believe um, two versions of PHP actually have this array notation, but um, yeah, definitely the PHP 5.5 .5 has this, in that re normally you create arrays this way, um, just use the, sorry about that guys, the array um, function here, and then you pass in which items you want the in the array so one two five nine okay but now php has this thing called shorthand notation you just use the square bracket like this and it's pretty much the same okay so this works as the same as the other one all right so enough rumbling about array creation um this is what you call a numbered array and it's numbered because you can access it by saying my array and then square brackets say two basically what that means is array start counting at zero so this number one here is the zero element so when i say zero that should equal to the number one and now when i say um one that should equal to the number two and last when i say two that should equal to the number five okay so that's how you access numbered arrays and you can loop through them as well using the for each loop. You don't have to use the key as well. So when you say for each, um, my array as item, and you can just say echo, for example, and then you just say item here. So that will just echo for you um, all these, number one, two, five, and nine, okay? So that's how you create and use um, numbered arrays. And um, yeah, that's that's all there is to it, guys. There's nothing complex. And in the next video, I'll cover associative arrays, which are slightly more complex than numbered arrays, but um, they pretty much do the same thing. So um, thanks for watching. I will see you in another video. Cheers. Bye bye.